For this video, I will show you guys how I made kimchi from RuPaul's Drag Race Season 8 using Duchess Swan. So for Duchess, I'm actually going to be transforming her into kimchi from RuPaul's Drag Race. If you guys aren't familiar with RuPaul's Drag Race, it's pretty much a female impersonating contest where you just have all these fun personalities and creative, artistic people and, you know, they just, you know, entertain. They're entertainers. I'm gonna be making kimchi with her first appearance because of her purple lavender hair. And that is what Duchess have. I'm really, really excited about this because it's so different. Drag makeup, it's not realistic. You know, it's not, it's an exaggeration of um, female features. So I'm really excited to do this on Duchess. First, I'm gonna go ahead and take acetone to remove her face. <laughs> So I'm pretty much finished with kimchi's face and I am so in love. This is very new to me and it was very experimental but she does literally look like kimchi. Like with the whole contouring with the cheeks being carved and her jawline, um, the eyes being exaggerated and she goes for the cartoon animated fantasy so I gave her that and I think she looks amazing. And I gave her lashes too. And these lashes, I don't know if you guys can see, are actually very, very thick. They're almost like triangle-like. And now we have to go ahead and make her dress and costume. But before that, I'm gonna go and set her hair and I'm gonna curl it. And I'm just gonna go ahead and use straws. So I have this um, lavender shirt that I think will work really really well for Kim Chi's dress so I'm just gonna go ahead and paste it on this one so I made a simple dress just for a base so that she's going to be covered up. For the geometric shapes, I cut out these two pieces over here. And this is going to go over her chest. But I'm going to glue this onto the fabric. I'll cut it out and then I will build it. just finish with the parts pretty much and so I have this one which is gonna go over her shoulder I'm not gonna attach it right now because I'm not done with her hair yet I also have this back piece over here so um, I'm just gonna glue this towards the back later 
but she does have a belt, a fabric belt, um, on her waist. So I'm gonna do that first before gluing everything down. So for these two parts, they kind of look plain to me and I don't know, I feel like Kim Chi would want it to be a little more, you know, detailed and stuff. So I'm just gonna decorate it with glue gun and um, maybe paint over it with something more lavender or maybe pinkish um, just to match her makeup or something. So while these are drying, I'm gonna go ahead and work on the shoe. I chose to use Kitty Cheshire's um, shoe. I think this is like the book picnic or something like that. And as you can see, she has like the books over here too. Um, pretty cool and I think it matches the outfit really well. I just have to obviously paint it um, like a brighter lavender to match everything else. So this is her shoes and I just dry painted it with um, darker purple and I also coated it with the pearly white color just to make it really shiny and highlighted. Now I'm going to go ahead and paint it with the pearly white finish. So now that we're pretty much done with all the pieces, I'm just going to go ahead and glue on the attachments. So this is how kimchi looks with her dress. It looks so cute. I actually painted the inside dark purple as well. The shoes are awesome. I think they match her really well. The next things that we need to really do is going to be her headdress. I need to find or make a necklace for her. And also we need to add her really really long nails. That is like a kimchi signature. For her like headpiece, I'm going to be using a really really thin cardboard. Um, so I will be making this contraption over here. And I'll just draw it really quick. So this is how the headpiece looks. Um, it's pretty cool. For her necklace, I just thought of using this necklace from CA Cupid. I just need to cut off the shoulder details over here. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and spray these two with metallic silver, and I'll coat it. I'll coat it with the pearly, the pearly white paint. So I just finish with both of them. I do want to work on her nails, so I'm gonna take this plastic. Cut it into really, really tiny, like, strips of, like, nail, like, acrylic. Um, I don't know if it's gonna work out. It's gonna be a trial, but we will see. 